Hello people. There are more and more signs that Samsung is working on a smart ring called Galaxy Ring, which can measure the indicators of your health and physical shape. Now, another evidence has been found indicating the upcoming launch of the Galaxy Ring. In the latest version of the Galaxy Wearable app, a new icon has appeared, reminiscent of a ring. There was no such icon before in the Galaxy Wearable app, so it is quite possible that a South Korean company is working on a smart ring and testing it through the Galaxy Wearable app. Although the Galaxy Ring is not yet known, there are rumors that it can be worn on your fingers, track workouts, measure heart rate, track sleep and do other things. It is expected that the Galaxy Ring will debut at the beginning of next year together with the Galaxy S24 series during the Galaxy Unpack 2024 event. Most of the available now smart rings do not belong to well-known brands. Thus, if Samsung introduces a smart ring next year, they will have a good chance to revolutionize the market thanks to the existing ecosystem of mobile products and a huge marketing budget. However, in order for this to happen, the ring should have reliable and accurate tracking accuracy health and fitness. Nevertheless, the Galaxy Ring can also swallow part of the sales of the Galaxy Watch from Samsung, since both the smart ring and smartwatch can do almost the same. Moreover, the Galaxy Ring can be cheaper than the Galaxy Watch, since the first does not have a screen, GPS, and some other functions. On the other hand, the ring may interest those people who do not dare to switch to smart watches, because they prefer traditional classic watches. While Apple has finally introduced the long-awaited iPhone 15 series with a USB-C port, Samsung also has a device ready for release. Supposedly, this device is the Galaxy S23 Fan Edition, and before its launch, official smartphone renders appeared, demonstrating the device in all its glory. Samsung can launch the Galaxy S23 FE in India at the end of this month or in October. This means that at about the same time, the phone can become available in other countries. The official renders, which came into the hands of the publication The Tech Outlook, show that the phone will have a design similar to the Galaxy S23. Judging by the renders, the Galaxy S23 FE will have a flat display, a notch in the center for a selfie camera, as well as volume and power buttons on the right edge of the phone. The rear panel of the Galaxy S23 FE has a triple camera, the main one is 50 megapixels, the ultra-wide angle is 12 megapixels and the telephoto is 8 megapixels. The phone will be equipped with a 6.4-inch AMOLED Full HD Plus display with a frequency of 120Hz. It is expected that in India the phone will be released with the Exynos 2200 processor, and on the US market a phone based on the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor may appear. And yes, if you ask me what is the difference between it and the Galaxy S22, then I will not find an answer. Everything will depend on the price, if it is low enough, then this phone will make sense. After some debates about whether the next wireless headphone Samsung will be called Galaxy Buds 2 Plus or Galaxy Buds 3, it turned out that these will be the first wireless headphone Samsung belonging to the FE line. Samsung confirmed the name Galaxy Buds FE in the leaked user manual, the one about which you could find out if you were subscribed to our Telegram channel by the link in the description or by finding it through the search for Technogary. Therefore, if you are not subscribed yet, be sure to do it, there is a lot of useful and as quickly as possible. This leaked material gave us some idea of the general design of the Buds FE and how they will differ from later models. But now the Galaxy Buds FE and the charging case attached to it were shown in a series of renders with a higher resolution. Once again, these renders confirm the new, or rather reinvented philosophy of the design of the upcoming Galaxy Buds FE. The future of the FA model, it seems, will borrow the idea of the original Galaxy Buds and Galaxy Buds Plus, released in 2019 and 2020 respectively. Like the 2019 and 2020 models, the future Galaxy Buds FE will have interchangeable rubber nozzles of different sizes for different ear shapes, intended to improve grip. In fact, what you see in the images is a pair of Galaxy Buds FE headphones wrapped in a rubber accessory, that is, this mount with a wing. The user manual, which was published earlier this week, confirmed that there are more traditional, wingless rubber nozzles of small and medium sizes. But we do not have a configuration render without these rubber pads, at least at the moment. Technical characteristics remain a mystery, but given the branding fun edition, we assume that Samsung wants to offer these headphones at a lower price than the Galaxy Buds 2 Pro model. What exactly are the functions of the Galaxy Buds FE will have to sacrifice in order to reduce the price is yet to be determined. In the original Galaxy Buds and Galaxy Buds Plus headphones, there was no active noise cancellation, but in the leaked user manual, 
it is said that Buds FE will benefit from both active noise cancellation and ambient sound. In general, we will see. In my opinion, a rather interesting model of new Samsung headphones is being drawn, and this is great. I will definitely keep you posted, so subscribe to the channel here, in Telegram, in general, wherever you find me, subscribe.